Hi, I'm Laura Delaney. Being down in Railway Cricket Club, my dad was coaching the team and Gareth and I, my younger brother, were always around the club um, and watching Niall O'Brien and Kevin O'Brien go out to Batley. I just remember we were always traipsing around the clubs watching Railway play. I play for Leinster Cricket Club in Athens. Charlotte Edwards or Susie Bates, probably more so because a few years ago I went over and I was a rookie for the Scorchers and I got to meet both those players. Growing up it definitely would have been a male player because I would never have seen much women's cricket on TV so it probably would have been Ben Stokes, I'm a, a big fan of Ben Stokes and how competitive he is. So. I actually can't remember my first wonder, but I can remember my last one last season. <laughs> um, and I was delighted to score runs. I'd been out for a while and it was so nice to just get back out onto the pitch and to contribute and to find some form before I went into our international series in the middle of the summer. So. I made my debut alongside Kim Garth and Mary Waldron. Mary, who still plays for Ireland, we played against New Zealand in Kibworth. It was an amazing experience. It came quite quickly, um, but to be honest, it was one, one opportunity that I was given and I think I've just gone with it every time I get an opportunity to go out and play for Ireland. It's so special um, and I'm incredibly lucky that I got to make my debut while my dad was head coach. So yeah. Oh, Cara is such a joker. Um, Lily Little and Orla Prendergast are, are definitely climbing that ladder at the moment though, but I'm gonna go with Cara Murray. You just never know what she has up her sleeve. I love playing in Pembroke. Um, I used to love playing in YM, which is where a lot of our international games would have been held up until last year when they had some issues getting into their ground, but thankfully they're back in the ground this year, so hopefully we might have some international fixtures there. There's no better feeling than going down to Pembroke or YM playing an international game and having the wall full of your family and friends. Uh, superstitions? No, but I am a bit OCD about my kit in the changing room. <laughs> I don't really like people getting near it. I'm very tidy and I like my things to be in a specific area, but no, no superstitions. That's it, Hope, and I feel like possibly qualifying for the first T20 World Cup back in 2014. That was a massive achievement for us as a group. It was the first time we qualified for a T20 World Cup, so we were all elated, but Qualifying for the ICC Championship in November was a goal that we'd been working towards for 24 months because the tournament had been pushed out with COVID, so playing against Holland in Zimbabwe probably might trump that. Are you back in green this summer? Get your tickets at cricketireland.ie forward slash tickets.